Uh... Very interesting girl. Who, Nicole? Ick, you don't really think she's interesting, do you? Well, I, I wanted to kind of talk to you about that, Rocket. About what? Well, I mean, you're a friend of mine. Tell me the truth. Do you think maybe she could like me? I mean, for real? <laughs> like you? You mean like-like? As in girlfriend or something? Well, yeah, you know. Oh, please, don't make me barf, Ruben. Is that what you wanted to talk to me about? Well, you know, it seems like she's kind of been paying pretty much attention to me lately. I just thought you... How were... should I know what's in the little mind of Nicole Whitaker? And believe me, I'm not the one who's going to go find out. Oh, sorry. So you don't think she likes me, huh? Ruben, if that's what you want, I'm sure you can make it happen. But right now, I've got to go. I've kind of had enough of this stupid party. Aw, oh, really, Rocket? How come? Aren't you going to be around after our next set? I doubt it. I really do. Anyway, I'm sure Nicole will be there to keep you company. Hey, yeah, that's a thought. Hey, thanks, Rocket. If you're really leaving, then I'll, I'll see you, okay? Maybe, maybe not. Well, this could be the end of my life as a cool person. I mean, if I ever even was one, that is. Max's party was only one of the worst things I ever went through, I would say. Nicole took every chance she could get to totally humiliate me, even though I'd already tried to make her feel better about what happened on the soccer field the other day. Even that backfired, because when I mentioned it, she goes, If you ever bring that up again, especially in public, you'll wish you never even moved here! Or something like that. Gall, this whole thing is just so complicated. <laughs>